this is day two at the Chris Orser Landscaping uh, Redeeming Wall Project. I mean, as you can see, the guys are still um, trying hard to get the uh, landscape timbers out. It's um, going a little bit slower than expected because the uh, the ground is frozen. It's about February when we're doing this, but we have a break in the weather, so we uh, decided to, to get this project done now. But the uh, timbers are coming out relatively okay. Um, again, the fact that they're frozen uh, is slowing things up a little bit, but um, as we kind of pan over here, here's some more of the material that we're going to use to grate just natural PA field stone, uh, wall stone, and it's just a great look for, uh, for this type of setting, which is kind of a more uh, naturalistic setting. I kind of want to take you over to the grass for a minute here. Where as we're bringing the stone back, um, you can see that the grass is pretty much how it looked before we started. Uh, and that's because we take every precaution uh, necessary to save the grass so it doesn't get turfed up or rutted up. It just saves um, time and, and cleanup at the end so your grass is looking healthy uh, after the project is over. We do have bobcats and skid steers and things like that to bring material back, but this particular job we're bringing all the stone and all the material back by wheelbarrow. Um, and again, that's why the grass is um, looking how it was before we started. So that's where we're at today, and we'll, we will bring you another update tomorrow on the, uh, the progress of the wall. The timber should be out, and the base stone at that point should be in. Um, again, if you want more information on this type of wall or any other type of um, landscaping, uh, you can get a hold of uh, Chris Orris for Landscaping at 215-249-1236 or visit us on the website at www.orserlandscaping.com.